in this session for a deep defending. Again, the principles will be to, as the ball's played in, to stay compact with applying pressure on the ball. As the ball moves and he comes in, can we be able to narrow in, being able to step, apply pressure, get numbers around the ball. When we win it, can we look to find a target? They can come into the grid and we can open up to establish possession against five. So the principles would be good principles of deep defending. And when we win the ball, can we maintain possession? The activity, as we're in, the coach will start the ball. These players are out of the grid as, as, as targets for the red team. But we start the ball in the blue. When that happens, the three and the two come in. And now they have a game seven against five. So obviously with numbers up, we're gonna be able to work very well on providing team cover and compactness collectively as a unit. As they move around, again, can we apply a pressure? Can we come round, narrow in? As it comes wide, can we apply a pressure, come round and make it compact? Once again, if we are to win the ball, the two and the three hop out of the grid, find the target, and now we can open up in the full half and we can play a game of possession for the red team, including, of course, the goalkeeper. Same goes if when blue has the ball and they try and make an action forward and we intercept, of course, we can find the goalkeeper. In this moment, can the goalkeeper look to, to keep possession right away or can we make more of a direct possession play to a target, come into the grid, and now expand the grid inside, making it a 8v5, including the goalkeeper. This gives the defenders a purpose to winning the ball and then they get the satisfaction of keeping it.